Louise Fletcher, who won the Best Actress Oscar for her indelible performance as Nurse Ratched in Milos Forman's One Flew Over the Cuckoo's Nest, died Friday at her home in France, she was 88. The classic 1975 film, Cuckoo's Nest, followed the patients and staff of an Oregon psychiatric hospital. The Milos Forman-directed film won five Oscars in 1976, including Best Actress, Best Picture and Best Director. Jack Nicholson won the Best Actor Oscar for his indelible performance as patient Randall P. McMurphy, who flouts the tyrannical rule of Nurse Ratched in the ward born in Alabama to deaf parents. Fletcher made one of the most touching acceptance speeches in Oscar history after her win. Clutching her Oscar at the 1976 ceremony, Fletcher told the audience, smiling, It looks as though you all hated me so much. But you have given me this award for it. And I'm loving every minute of it. All I can say is, I've loved being hated by you. She then tearfully addressed her deaf parents in Birmingham, Alabama, talking and using sign language. I want to thank you for teaching me to have a dream. You are seeing my dream come true. The character was so memorable she would become the basis for a Ryan Murphy Netflix series, Ratched, 45 years later, starring Sarah Paulson as Nurse Mildred Ratched. Fletcher also starred as a psychiatrist in Exorcist II, The Heretic, 1977. On TV, she portrayed Bodger and religious leader Kai Win Adami on Star Trek Deep Space Nine from 1993 to 1999. She played the controlling mother of the famed title character in the 1989 biopic, The Karen Carpenter Story. In 1996 Fletcher was nominated for an Emmy Award for a guest appearance on Picket Fences, playing the mother of Mayor Lori Bay, Marley Matlin. Fletcher more recently played William H. Macy's meth-dealing, foul-mouthed mother on Showtime's Shameless, appeared in the Liev Schreiber film, A Perfect Man, 2013, and on the Netflix series, Girl Boss. Starring Britt Robertson.